Central Ohio family terrorized in their home. And they say the thieves left behind an ugly evidence trail. It all happened in the 800 block of Livingston Avenue on the east side. Fox 28 reporter Rob Wells is live at CPD headquarters tonight with an update for us. Rob? Bob, this is a copy of that Columbus police report. It says that thieves hit the same home not only once, but twice in less than a week. Now the victims say they're afraid about what could be next. 70-year-old Mary Davis says thieves left a bloody trail around her doors, windows, and even drapes after cutting themselves while busting in Monday night. I'm afraid to go to sleep. I'm afraid for my seven-year-old, and I've always been good to everybody. Davis says while nothing was taken Monday night, the thieves returned yet again on Tuesday. She thinks they were there to make off with what they had found the night before. I thought if I come back in and see my daughter, granddaughter dead, or and her boyfriend, I could never live with it because I've been through too much. Davis's granddaughter was there Tuesday night when the suspects returned. She knew that something was wrong when she heard noises from the kitchen and spotted three men in the window. I heard this window again. I said, look, I called the cops. They're on the way. And that's when the door shut and then they went over the fence. The family says while nationwide children's hospital development nearby has helped improve the community, it hasn't wiped out crime. In the meantime, Mary Davis says she's ready if the bad guys return tonight. I've got me a billy club, and I'm being honest with you, and I've got a knife to wait on them this time. They ain't taking nothing from me no more. They're not hurting me no more. In the meantime, Davis spotted what she says is a suspicious looking blue van casing her neighborhood right before those break ins. She's hoping that that piece of information will hopefully help crack the case. For now, reporting live at CPD headquarters, Rob Wells, Fox 28 News.